All right. So Lizzie, uh, it's so great to see you back in action. But why did you decide to come back for such a hard race? <laughs> uh, they're all hard these days, unfortunately. Uh, women's cycling is getting stronger and stronger and there's no easy race to return anymore. I think that's clear. So I know it's going to be painful wherever I start. And um, the team needed me, actually. You know, they've had some really bad luck with injuries and illness. And I think they have a really good chance here to win the race. So if I can do just something, it's better than being at home training. At least I'm here to help. Uh, it's great that you say that because your team is very strong. You have several cards to cards to play, like Elisa Logo, Borghili, You have Cheryl Valoroy, very strong, uh, and you have you have you your experience to to share to help them. Yeah, I mean, I of course I have a lot of experience here. Um, I'm very relaxed uh, and excited to race with the girls, and I think. At least I hope to have some influence on the team morale and to keep everybody uh, enthusiastic, motivated, but most importantly relaxed because we really should be. We have so many opportunities and uh, yeah, there's nothing to be stressed about. We're here to have fun. How do you combine uh, cycling with your uh, family life? Uh, it's a complete balancing act, like riding a bicycle. I'm always trying to keep balance. Sometimes uh, it gets difficult, but uh, I love I love the life I have now. And when do you expect to be in a, in a very good shape to get some personal results? Um, I guess it will take some time to come back in the race with them. I have some really good fitness now, but it's nothing compared to racing. So I hope sometime maybe June, around June time. So it's about uh, yes, the, the Grand Tours then? Yeah, exactly. The yeah. yeah, there's more and more opportunities in the summer. It's not just about spring. So um, there's a lot of races that I will target later in the season. Thank you. Okay.